welcome to crack Void. as you know that android 12 beta 1 is released already and i have installed this android 12 which is in beta 1 phase on redmi note 5 pro and in this video i'll show some features of this android 12 on redmi note 5 pro also i'll show the installation process of this android 12 room on redmi note 5 pro so without further ado let's get started This is Redmi Note 5 Pro and I have already installed Android 12 Beta 1 ported room in it. It is in beta phase so you might see some bugs in this room. It has new quick toggles with a rounded rectangular shape and you can change quick files looks by clicking on system UI GX. Then that new quick toggles and clock styles on lock screen will be replaced by the older versions of Android 11. And if you enable that system UI GX, then you'll get new quick toggles with new and attractive clock format on lock screen. And that accent colors and colors of clock on lock screen will be changed according to the colors of your wallpaper. This is also a new feature by Android version 12. And in this quick file settings, there are many features like screen recording, night light, battery saver, etc. And if you enable battery saver, then your current theme will be changed to dark theme. And dark theme also has pitch black dark effect. Also, there is edit icon on notification panel from where you can add or remove toggles. Now I'll go to about phone settings and you can see Android version is Android S which is Android 12 but when you click and open it then it shows the older version of Android 11. Later on further update it will be fixed. There is Android security patch of May 5, 2021. And for those who like to watch mukbang videos, you can check our Cracksoap YouTube channel where I'll be uploading new mukbang videos i'll provide channel link on the top of the description section so go check it out and enjoy there is google camera available which works fine you can take pictures and videos from it also google call dialer and message app are available now i'll show that play store is certified or not and you can see on play protect certification device is certified written which means you will not face any error while downloading apps and using banking applications and from the recent app section you can directly take screenshot and also share and edit them now let's go to the settings section and see what new features are available there and the look of setting section is also completely changed. At first there is network and internet and as on Android 11 there is private DNS feature available. And in this Android 12 you can enable hotspot and Wi-Fi at the same time. And now I'll go to the notification settings. There is conversations, bubbles, recently sent notifications from where you can see which app has sent you notification recently. There are other features like notification history, sensitive notification, do not disturb, hide silent notification in status bar and some other notification settings. Now I'll enter into app setting at first there is recently used apps and below there is default app setting, assistant, screen time and special app access. There is also digital well-being and parental control setting available and inside battery setting there is view battery uses, battery server, adoptive preferences and battery percentage. And on sound and vibrations, there are all useful settings available. And on display settings, adoptive brightness is available, but this does not seem to work. There are some other similar settings available like lock screen, screen timeout, dark theme, font and display size, colors, night light, screen saver, etc. On styles and wallpapers, you can customize fonts, 
icons and many other things you can also change wallpapers from here and on security you can see android security update of may 5 2021 and for device security password and fingerprint are available but in this redmi note 5 pro face unlock is not available but it will be available on further updates and on advanced section you can see phone is not encrypted but later on future update it will be encrypted as well and there is privacy setting available from where you can control all the privacy of your device at one place and on system there is gestures setting and lots of new and interesting gestures are available but due to beta version all gestures does not work properly there is feature swipe fingerprint for notifications to check notifications swipe down on the fingerprint sensor on the back of your phone there is another new feature which is swipe for notifications here you have to swipe down on the bottom edge of the screen to show your notifications and this feature is working properly and i find this feature handy and useful as well and there are some other features available like Quickly open camera, one handed mode, double tap to check phone, lift to check phone, prevent ringing and power menu. On system navigation, gesture navigation is working properly and on power menu there is hold for assistant, device controls and sensitive content settings are available. And on system setting, there are some other features like backup, system update, multiple users, reset options, etc. And on about phone, you can see the details about your device like Android version, SIM status, etc. And at last, there is tips and support from where you can get lots of information about how to use your phone properly and lots of other tips and tricks are also available. Also, you can get help support from here. There is also new widgets organization which looks really good and is more improved. In this Android 12, lots of new features are added and you will be able to completely personalize your phone with a custom plate and redesigned widgets so this is all about android 12 new features and this android 12 looks really improved and packed with lots of customizations than ever and if you want to install this android 12 beta rom on your redmi note 5 pro then download this ported rom from the description below all the credit of this rom goes to respective developer who ported android 12 rom for redmi note 5 pro now go to any custom recovery mode i have installed orange fox custom recovery if you don't know how to install custom recovery on redmi note 5 pro then watch my video to install custom recovery from the description section so we are now in orange fox custom recovery first go to wipe section and select dalvi cas then the system and data then swipe right to wipe them now go back to file section and select that room file that you have downloaded then swipe to right to confirm flash this will take some time to flash room file so i'll fast forward this process now the room is flashed now go back to wipe section and go to format data and type yes and click on tick mark and then your phone will format and then click on reboot system then the phone will reboot to system and you will have android 12 rom installed on your redmi note 5 pro so in this way you can install this android 12 beta 1 rom on redmi note 5 pro this rom is in beta phase and is not fully stable so you may face lots of bugs in this rom so i don't recommend to flash this beta rom on your device but you can flash but you can flash when the stable update rolls out if you are adventurous and want to experience android 12 on your device then only install this android 12 beta room and for other users please wait until the official stable update for your device 
so i'll be wrapping out this video here thank you very much for watching this video you can like share and subscribe to our crack soy youtube channel that's it for today i'll come with another informative and interesting video until then goodbye take care and stay safe